Guys, it's currently 9.47 p.m. I'm calling my friend and she's not answering her phone. And honestly, whenever she doesn't want to come early, she doesn't answer the phone and then calls me later on and say, Oh, I just woke up. I don't think she knows that I know that she does that. But whatever. Um, I'm ready. I have my coffee ready to go. Packed away the food and Tupperware. Put it in the fridge. I'm waiting for the rice to cool down a little bit before I put it in the fridge. Mia is fed. Like, everything is literally ready to go. another bottle for Mia and put in the fridge because sometimes she needs to be fed when I'm gone so um you know I just make the bottle so that it's ready to go to make life a little bit easier just pop it in the bottle warmer and it's ready to go but um yeah pretty much ready for work I feel like this Christmas does not really feel like Christmas or it doesn't feel like the Christmas that I'm used to in the Caribbean something about Christmas in the Caribbean that is so very different from um the holidays here. I feel like hair or life or really is just work, come home, sleep to get some energy to go back to work the next time and it's just a toxic cycle. And now I understand why people in the United States take vacations so seriously and they take their vacations. Okay? Because before I'm like, what is the hype? <laughs> I'm going on a trip. No, you need that vacation because if all you do is work, work, work the entire year, there's going to come a time in the year where you feel so burnt out, where you feel like you need to go somewhere and reset and recharge, okay? I get it. I really do get it. So this is the bottle for later if she needs it. If she's up until then, I ideally would have tried putting her to sleep, but she's not sleeping right now. The nanny comes in another 15 minutes or so. I'm going to tell her that whenever she falls asleep to just put her down. I'm going to try and see if I can like pat her to go to sleep from now. I don't know if that's going to work out or not, but one can only try. Hi guys. It is a rainy, rainy day in New York. I look a little wild. And that's mainly because I have my hair out. I went through and rebraided my hair. For my U part right so um i'm gonna go through with the crochet hook and like loop it into itself so i loop it onto itself and then i have this left out i need to dye this piece black but I'm not concerned right now and then here is the u part this one jewel said she wanted it i gave it to her she wasn't wearing it i took it back because I wear mine all the time. So I'm gonna go ahead and plop her on there. And I have this one little anchor braid right here for it to be able to go on. And I have clips to be able to snap it down. Oh. We have another one here. Then we go around. that bad boy back there and this is what she's looking like I have my middle part this one is a little bit thin fresh off of Amazon I haven't added any hair or anything to it so let's see you see where this hair is and this is my hair and for me over the last couple of years this has been the absolute best protective style I haven't had to do too much hold on and then I'm going to just go through with this straightener. Okay, y'all. So this is what it looks like straightened. It's very light. So it could easily look like my hair because when I straighten my hair, it's light. Basically looking like I don't have hair on my head. Very light and very thin like this. Which is not a bad thing. So now I'm going to go through and I'm going to curl it with the curler power this one off because i want it to basically be body wave so this one i love it so i can basically just buy one bundle and add to it even though i feel like there got to be a wig in there that i could really shake down and take tracks out of it to add to this 
And I think I know just the way, but I can't be bothered to do this right now. Maybe when I'm off. Right now it's okay exactly how it is. So here's the curl over here. We're gonna put some holding spray on there to basically hold the curls. And these curls are gonna last me all week. I'm gonna come back and show you when this side is done. Feeling so cute. This is what the hair looks like, you guys. Um, it looks thin and typically this bothers me, but right now it really does not because I'm just like, I'm not going anywhere but work. One, two, it is not at all that serious. I'm always too much in my head and I really don't need to be. But you see how I looked before and how I look now? Honey, get your hair done. If you feel like shit, let somebody do your hair if you can't do it yourself. Okay, bye. Hi y'all, it's 5.15 p.m. I just showered, made me out a bottle. We're gonna go in the bedroom, change her diaper, feed her. And then we are going to sleep. I put her high chair together, let me show you guys that. So cute, as y'all know my apartment is small, so that's where it's at and the two chairs are on the other side of the table, but so cute. I'm so functional, she'll be able to use it for a long time, it's just the apartment is small. Anyways, that's it for now. I'm gonna go do all that I said we're gonna go do and I'll see you guys later or so. Hi everyone, as usual, I pop in sporadically here and there to update you guys on whatever I have going on in my life. That sounds more exciting than it actually is. I finally got my package from Bath & Body Works Candle Day with um, some of the candles that I love and keep repurchasing every single year. This one. This is my first time repurchasing it. It was my first time purchasing it last year. But, you know, Mahogany and Teakwood. Always, always, always buy that. Uh, Tis this season, I bought that last year and I really enjoyed it. So I got it again. Sweater weather. I love that. I have Marshmallow Fireside. I think I tried that already. You know, just a few really coffee and whiskey. Coffee and whiskey. I'm really, really, really excited about it. I think I'm going to put that in the, um, the living room. But, yeah. I got the package and I wanted to pop in and just basically update you guys. Uh, I'm going to go in the living room and do a quick workout. I'm going to stock some of those in my um, in the TV stand where I have the rest of my candles and then the rest of them are going to just sit in the box, meaning the closet or so, because I don't really have anywhere else to store them right now. Among all of the baby things that I do have in the apartment right now, I really don't have space for anything else. So one thing about having a baby in a small apartment, the baby appliances. Anyways, see you guys later.